All right, this is the moment that every mixed martial arts athlete hopes will materialize the number one heavyweight contender making the walk for his first title fight here in the U.S. I mean, the nerves are going crazy for this man right now. He's so nervous. Has he done everything he needs to do? Has he not left any stone unturned? He says that he has prepared. He says that his body's ready. His mind's ready. He feels physically good in the spot. He's taking on a long-rated champion. If he's going to get this done, it's going to take something truly special. He does not believe jitters will be a factor here tonight. He has built his career methodically to this point. We'll see if we hear the words and new by night 10. I mean, come on, DC. Mike Tyson with this DMX intro backdrop. I'm anxious as if I'm fighting. This is a huge moment for the history of mixed martial arts and for the International Boxing Hall of Famer, Mike Tyson. It all works together. It really just all works together whenever you watch Mike Tyson from the song to the, the look to the bobbing of the head to the posse. Iron Mike Tyson is just one of those guys that draws you in, and he is bringing a lot of new eyes to the UFC octagon. He can wrestle a little bit too, John, so don't be surprised if on the first shot, Mike Tyson hits him with the big sprawl to defend his leg. Only thing I can guarantee you, he's not gonna be taking any bites of cauliflower ear <laughs> in the octagon tonight. We're certainly happy to have Mike Tyson. Let's see how it goes. Mike Tyson steps inside the octagon. He is ready to fight. And now let's get you our tail of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. The veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, Assassin. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. All right, Herb Dean, third man Ready. in the octagon for this one. Ready. Let's do it. All right, so here he is, Iron Mike Tyson, formerly the baddest man on the planet. You know the flurry is coming. He'll throw uppercuts and hooks, use that signature peekaboo style, and get inside. On the other side, look for his opponent to try to take him down and neutralize the striking game of Mike Tyson. If you can't get him to the canvas, you're likely in for a short night at the office. Early connection with the left from the champ. Straight right, he misses. Beautiful job getting those hands up. Oh, nice job by him there to slip that offer. He's so bad. Some more output, at least in the early going. Right idea, wrong execution. The counter right is no good. And a nice left hand there on the inside. Let's go, you can do this. And that's, that's the danger in the engagement there. Oh, nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Effective use of the jab there by Tyson. Uppercut attempt nearly connects, but no good. And that left hook landed on the 
button. Beautiful work on the feet tonight by Tyson. The one two punch is true. Just over three minutes to go round one. He missed with that jab attempt there. Both fighters throwing heat now. All right, so now we start to see some bruising appearing on the torso and all of that courtesy of the body work of his opponent. Just the, the wherewithal to go to the body and the discipline to stay with that approach. I mean, it's just tremendous. You, you see a fighter with a high fight IQ following the game plan, and it's working. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. Miss with the right hook. Oh, nice count, yes. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tough, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. All right, there it is. Another strike targeting that damaged area on the body. Is this a game plan thing or perhaps trying to set something up high later on? Well, I think it's, I think it's all, it all works together. You get the hands to start to drop, and then when those hands drop, you go over the top with that head kick. But beating up the body sets up the attacks up top, and that is exactly what this guy is doing. Tyson's hook shot blocked. That one was telegraphed. Good job by the defense. It's a pretty good jab. 90 seconds to go. Oh! Massive left hand. Oh! Oh! Yeah. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Nice strike by him. Oh, that's so good. Back to the feet. So under a minute to go here in what has been a competitive and action-packed first round. All right, well, good news is he rocked and bad news is he wasn't able to finish the job and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, you don't get those opportunities very often. You got to take full advantage of them when they're presented to you. Well, and that kick is blocked. Oh, another beautiful body shot there. You see the damage starting to accumulate. Maybe some defense would be wise at this point in the fight. I think so, John. You can't just get beat up to the body. It doesn't show itself right away. It takes time whenever you're beating. Oh, he dove and he lands. Right up. All right, trying to pass here. As Glover Teixeira might say, not today. Not today. Great job of following with the hips, keeping those legs locked and keeping them in full guard. Oh, horn sounds for the end of round one. Oh, stop, stop. All right, there's the horn indicating stop. the end of the round. You see the cut just above the eye from that round. So the right, cut listen, man's got to get down. in here, close that thing up. You don't want right. it becoming an issue here into this next round. It's not a big deal. We've been knocked down before. All right? This time I want you to go... All right, so there's the end of the round, and on one side, thrill on the other, agony after that knockdown. Yeah, he was able to really damage him with that big punch. You see the hands, the speed, how sharp he is, how technical he is. It allows him to land in spots where his opponent is winging punches. Great strike landed, great punch landed to put his opponent down. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, second round underway. That was great head move. Oh, Straight punch land. Tyson. This strike attempt there is blocked. Beautiful connection lands. Fighting long is the key. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the back. Oh, he hurt him! Circling to his right. 
vision could become an issue in that left eye starting to close. Nicely done to the body. Well, you gotta think he's gonna enjoy watching this one back tomorrow morning. He has landed a ton of significant strikes and really a guy who has been a monster in the gym finally putting it together here in the octagon. To go home and admire your work, it doesn't take till the next morning. He's going back to the room right now and firing up the video to look at beauty and actions. And he was the one causing all the action. Counter jab snaps the head back. That should get his attention. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Nice punch by Tyson. Well, he was knocked down by his opponent earlier in the round, and I'm not sure he's mentally back in this fight. Well, it's hard to build back from something like that. But as you watch, he's trying, but we don't know what type of dialogue is going on within himself, within himself right now in regards to him believing or not having much confidence in his approach to this fight. You wonder if the offensive fighter's gonna start to get frustrated here. Most stiff on all of these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Postures up and now goes with the big strike to the body. Well done there by Tyson. Beautiful ground and pound. And it looks like he has a cut now. And another, another strike from the top lands for him. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Well, that nose isn't going to be able to take too many more as he doubles up on the jab there. So good to watch MMA ball and watch guys now fight behind the jab. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Well, we got a lot of blood now, ladies and gentlemen. I think my mother just turned... Oh! That is it! Holy smokes! With a massive highlight at the Garden! Oh, my goodness. And here once more, Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at three minutes, three seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Mike Tyson. Well, who would have thought that the former boxing champion